Cheers and welcome my friends, I'm Harotrak and we are playing Europa Neo Solace 4 with the newest DLC, Golden Century. Welcome back to Venice, um, our playthrough on hard difficulty. So, we're still at war with Brunei. Uh, we had a couple of atrocious naval battles, but we've actually managed to claw back here. Um, by uh, actually like just engaging at clever times, something that I didn't excel at before. <laughs> So yeah, that is that is pretty much uh, the thing right now. So yeah, there's still a Moroccan fleet over here and everything, but we're gonna be probably able to pretty easily land our our other armies that we have over here. We had one army completely destroyed, but we'll probably be able to get the other ones and make sure that we take from Makassar the provinces, uh, from, from Malacca the provinces that we want to take and so on. Okay, so as soon as I... As soon as I move out, these guys are committed now. Damn it, why are these, why are these people so fast? They're always faster than... than I can go anywhere. Um, where's that port? Is that port here? Or is that port over here? Straits of Johor. Yeah, okay. So this is still Strait of Johor then. Alright. Um, put these guys onto the ship. And... I think we're just gonna go down here. Siege back our stuff. I think that's how it's gonna go. Okay, so we have peasants in Malta. It's probably not a problem. I think these guys should be able to deal with it. But yeah, the, the war weariness is a definite problem. Loss of prestige, sure. We converted Hawaii. Very good. Very good. Let's repay some loans. I got a ton of money still. Oh wait, what are these guys doing? Are they landing troops? I don't like that at all. They're being engaged by the knights. Do you really have what it takes to go after that fleet? Really? Um, I mean, I guess I could help them. Maybe we'll just send, like, the... The ten lights over. That was a big Moroccan fleet here too. Don't think they can do much. Are the knights moving further? You guys, yeah, they're actually moving after this fleet too. Okay, we're gonna help them. I think this is not a bad idea. Come on, this fort should fall now. Okay, bring these guys over. So there are ten lights. These guys should actually be prepared. That's probably the thing that we should do. <laughs> an extreme monsoon no I don't I don't care about things being destroyed there this is fine now oh, wait what we'll do is we'll ferry these guys over here to like ah siege of Panambang is over hello we're a bunch of heavies this should not be doable for them here I don't think yeah we'll, we'll take this And uh, put these guys on the ships. We're, we're against a bit of a timer here. Just because the game apparently thinks that we already won this. I mean, we won against Brunei, but not against any of the others. At least we have a wall breach over here. It's still going to be slow. I built that level 6 fort over here, and now I'm paying for it. <laughs> Mm 
We need to take Marcus, uh, Patani back over here too. But yeah, this is probably gonna be the end. What do they have here? This is just transport ships, I guess. Where are these guys going? Coast of Plamen Gang. I wonder if I can't catch those guys. Probably just with the loss of these ships, though. Um, a bunch of these are heavy frigates. A bunch of them aren't. Let's upgrade these. This place could really use a grand shipyard. I think it's in a very strategically useful location. So why not make that a thing? Siege that one back. There's still enemy fleets moving about with impunity. Uh, I'm not sure if these guys actually need to be located. I'll actually try to hunt these guys down. Damn it. I failed the knights. I have an exceptional year. Yeah, let's go national tax modifier. Why not? Yeah, I failed the knights again. God damn it. Well, we have a second fleet coming in now, so that's good. Oh, we're still building in a bunch of provinces. We just don't see it yet. Yeah, we're not quite done. Not quite done, but we'll get there. Huge fleet building program. Hey. So Kodiak is done improving. This one and this one. <sighs> we have a colonist over here. Oh, that was one that didn't have a colonist though, so I guess that's fine. I will take your lands, Pelumbang. And you will feel the effect of that. I have another level 6 fort over here. Man, that's going to be so annoying. These guys consist of forts. Ooh. Atse actually appeared here. Wasn't that like Spanish a while ago? Maybe they freed themselves. I know that I tried to take him a while back. Hmm, actually blockading me over here. God damn it. Well, there's no point in holding this place. I guess we're just gonna come over here. Try to hurt him. I think we're done building ships now. So, I'm holding control, by the way, to select all these guys. Uh, so that I don't select the... The, the troops. Okay, so we're gonna destroy that Bruni's fleet. Got a couple more light ships. I'll take that. Take these light ships, send them to Sumba, I guess. We can collect them later. Uh, this has been reverted now, that occupation. But we'll put them, put them on the ship. And... Bring him over here, I guess, together with all the heavies. Okay, so there are more, another 19 heavies more. And here we'll do just the same. Collect them all. Bring them over here. Well, at least we have a war breach. So listen, I think what we're gonna do is we're just gonna start dropping people on Malacca. That's what we need. Okay, with imperialism, apparently Mali just got free, I guess. Let's 
Okay, so we'll send these guys over here. And we'll send these guys over here. These guys need to be blockaded. There can be no place where they feel safe. Okay, so the Briggs. I'll just send into here. With these guys will need to engage this fleet. Yep, that's that. Hey, we captured a heavy. Which we're gonna send to <clears throat> repair down here. Let's come back into that Z zone. And they've run away again. Sure. Well, we'll see how long you can run away. Oh, we're being engaged over here. Really? Okay, so we've got our place back. Let's push there. Ooh, captured five ships. A couple more lights. So the Eastern Fleet... I'm gonna keep for here. We'll bring those guys over. And these will just keep in the area, I think. Okay, we've got Johor. Move into Malacca now. We're not even blockading all of this. This is a very what? Russia has a province here? How dare you? <laughs> That's not gonna fly. We're gonna take that away from Russia. Russia has no business being here. Well, yeah, I guess we have to accept it for now. So, right, we're gonna split that off. And uh, I think we'll use the heavies to come out here. Catch that fleet. We'll upgrade all these to the heavy frigates. Those are just transports. I don't think they should really hold up to our other ships. Want these guys in the frigate fleet, though. I think that would be kind of nice. Yeah, let's have influential trading family. That's fine. We captured 11 transports. I'm not sure what we're going to do with all these crappy transports. I guess we're just going to get rid of them. I'm not interested. I have more than enough transports at this point. Uh, these guys are running. Oh, that's, that's Byzantium actually doing some work. I like it. That was a successful conversion. We're running out of conversion targets at this point. That's also very good. Very, very good. Um, yeah, it does look like... We should probably pick these guys up and move them to Malacca. Come on, we can do it. on the ship, bring them over here. Actually, we'll just, just bring them towards Johor then. Move into CX. This doesn't have a zone of control, which is fine. Uh, so merge these. Upgrade some of the ships. Some of these guys could be upgraded too. Bring that ship to that fleet. Merge him. Man, we're not even blockading everything in this area. That is a bit nasty. There's nothing to blockade there either. Should probably just move on our own. Tell bang, you're gonna get fully annexed. Let's deal with it. 
Election. Okay, lottery. Five five zero. Oh man, that's that sucks. Mm. I guess there's nothing much I can do about having a five five zero leader. <coughs> we'll just live with the fact that that's the hand that we dealt. But we can also try to kill the dude. I guess. Oh, that's not a bad leader though, militarily. Two, five, two. Sure. Don't mind if I do. Yes! Bring the fleet out, buddy. Okay, I've captured three more lights. Early frigate, frigate, heavy frigate. They have all times. Ooh, yeah. Um, so, this is the, the Colonial Cascadia. This is... Um, Venetian Alaska. Right. So, Venetian Alaska now exists. I guess. This is done. It was almost done. Yeah, we should probably start like building building universities in your provinces, I guess. And here, I guess we'll start with a manufactory, and then we'll see what we what you can do. I think that that sounds good. All things considered. Um. Merge these guys. Yeah, let's upgrade the, the lower level ones. Do we want to land over there? Yeah, we'll probably have to. If I want to take as much land as I can from Malacca. Because we just have to kind of push. This is going to be worth it. No worries. This is totally going to be worth it. So we'll took Patani now. Uh, rather, we should probably blockade it. For now at least. Well. Malacca may get a crossing penalty. That's interesting. Venice may get a crossing penalty. Let's see if we can do it this time. We have a much better leader in charge this time. It looks like we're gonna do it. Come on. Awesome. How far are they gonna run? Are we gonna be able to stack wipe them? We should. Wham. And we'll get over there. Ah, they might be able to save their army. Nope. Okay, that's good. Uh, we've got this. So if we siege this down too, we have like 100% of them. Which is very good. So we'll kill all these dudes. Where are you running to, buddy? Okay, we captured a bunch more ships. Sent that frigate in here. I have a couple of very low health ships in here. Send them out. Yeah, no, this is like a little bit fiddly. This type of micromanagement, I guess. Play catch with this army, I guess. All right, so Palembang. We'll try to take as much from you as we can. Or is there anything particularly noteworthy province that you have for trade? No. Uh, 
Okay, we're not gonna care about coalitions or anything. It's just not a thing that we're interested in. Okay. Black flag now. Right. I guess we're just gonna close the deal on these dudes. Once we get that back, we're gonna be able to take more space. Palambang needs a lot of points. Oh man, that's a 27 development province. Okay, it's gonna be difficult to convert that, but uh, I guess we can do a lot. Force march costs no power. Global naval engagement plus 20%. I think artillery damage from back row is nice, but this is probably much better for all our naval engagements. Um, upgrade this. I think we can send the heavy to join this fleet again. Right. I'll try to engage these dudes now. I'm guessing. Uh, let's split. Yes, industrial urbanization. The growing economy of Istria is attracting people from the entire Great Republic to the province. A steady trickle of people are leaving the countryside to seek out new work opportunities and a new life in the city of Trieste. That's pretty nice because we're losing manpower in Patani, where we totally don't care about it. We're losing it basically from a territory into one of our core areas. And that's just what we like. Just what we like. Oi, these guys are stopping us from coring it. I don't like that. That's rude. Oh, they have 107% uh, discipline. Not too bad. Not too shabby. How's our war exhaustion? Ah, it's looking pretty bad. We gotta get out of this. And soon. How's my overextension? 31%. Yeah, it's gonna make it difficult to take a lot from Malacca here. Don't like that. Okay, we captured no ships this time. But we won the Siege of Patani. Very good. Okay, so this is going to be the end of this army. Yep, they got stack wiped. Now um, that kind of does it for Patani as a whole, I think. Actually, that's not true. There's like a, an island over here. It's not important for trade, but. Um, we could still try to get it. Can we? Can we even afford to 100% this? Spend some money here. How far? Are we? We're still ah, we're behind. We really want the three deckers too. Having that additional naval morale could be critical. We could just go for a second war here. How much do you really have? That's critical. We need these two. We need these two, and probably the Strait of Johor. Ah, uh, we hear Johor as well. I call for peace is pretty annoying. Like, the war is obviously not won. And yet, I'm uh, getting this, this message. I would, like, need to win harder. Hey, we sunk the flagship of the Malacan Navy. I like that. Total destruction for the Navy. Oh, we have a ship at like 0% that we captured. Holy hell. That's crazy. <laughs> okay. Sure. 
merge these armies again. Cylon Corps, Venetian Corps, Egypt Corps. Oh wait, we can actually get at that via the straight. These guys have joined... I tell you what, we're gonna build a spy network on these guys. And I will like declare another war right away. Right after we finish the other one. These guys are allied with Malacca and Palambang. That's gonna be the kill for them. But they are too stupid to see that this is gonna wipe them out. Oh yeah, let's make sure that we... Ooh, Makassar is already very expensive to pay for the conversion. Manis lost a good chunk of its northern land to Malwa. Really doesn't like me. I guess I can't blame them all that much. Oh well. Oh, these guys are drilling the elephants. That's why this looked so weird. Definitely an odd sight. There's still a Malaccan fleet here. The remnants of the Malaccan fleet. Okay, we capture another ship, another light. This policy is actually pretty crazy. Like, I didn't think we would capture that many ships. I had no idea. These guys can probably just go. We have one more merchantman. Oh wait, what's that? Bhutan separatists? Belonging to Brunei? That's not good. That's not good at all. Onto the transport you go. Deliver them onto this island. We want to like, take big chunks of Brunei, but we also want to take big chunks of Malacca. Um... So, let's check that again. We need these two, these two, and Johor, I guess. So, listen, Malika. This one, this one, this one. Okay, that's all I can take for now. 43% over extension. Why do I take these two? Hmm. How much population does this place have? 30. Oh man. That one's 15, that one's 14. I mean, if I do this, this is totally gonna screw them over because they can't pass through anymore. I guess. I guess this is what we'll do. space for money to take but do we really want money I don't think so hmm our extension is gonna be pretty brutal we don't take this ah no we take it why not why not take something Right, okay, so these guys are actually leaving our lands. It's very nice of them. Right, it's very nice of them to just leave. Now all we have to deal with is Brunei. Uh, where are our ships? Just getting there. Oh yeah, these guys are black flagged. We should probably make sure that they are well cared for. So, uh, bring all our fleets back home, I think. This is good. Big problem is that we're dangerously overextended. I kind of have to wait a little bit, but the war exhaustion is just killing me. 
gain one stability and for the next 10 years more manpower recovery oh and less war exhaustion oh man it's really hard to decide between that and uh restrict imports Oh man, that is a difficult decision to make. That is a really difficult decision to make, but I still think we'll we'll trust in what we know. Yep, okay, more mercantilism. Where are we standing now on mercantilism? 85 percent <laughs> that's a lot uh, call for peace is rough for sure call for peace is very rough at this point especially in the newer provinces so let's get rid of the frigates merge these we have now a, a huge fleet over here um Take these guys. Put two on separatists. I don't care for your mission. <sighs> It'll end in a way that I can't take any land from from Brunei because I took so much land from the other people in the war. That would be pretty crazy. Whoa! Really, forty-six k? Don't have a one number smaller. Ah, we won't do it below that. Definitely need a, a fort in there. Actually, I need a fort in this one, Polopo. Let's destroy the workshop, and let's start building a fort. Can definitely be a level eight fortress. Why not? Probably doesn't have to be, but. Sometimes helps. Yeah, I won't be able to stop these guys. At least not right now. I have no idea why Makassari separatists are happening over here. Makassar never... Oh no, that's actually not true. Okay. Right. Take that back then, I guess. Oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man, this is gonna go so wrong. I guess what we'll do is we'll push diplomacy. Do we really? Nah, we won't. What we could do is take a dude that reduces revolt risk, maybe? Let's see if that's something that we can achieve. That would be helpful, I guess, for a little while. Um. Uh, some of these, that's still two years of that kind of uh, revolt stuff running in our country. But if I if I peace out Brunei now, Oldenburg is like, oh no, they already made peace with them. <laughs> so Brunei really isn't at war with anyone right now. Okay. Let's come over here. I don't care about the separatism all that much. It's not really a problem for me. But the future overextension in combination with the extremely high war exhaustion is gnarly. National unrest is probably very high at this point. Yeah, 11. Okay, let's take that back. So we have this one protecting these two, and we have that one protecting these. And then we're gonna need this one as a separate thingy. Guess that's fine. Won't be okay. I don't wanna go over the overextension, but it we might have to bow out of this just to get rid of the poor exhaustion. I mean, I can probably keep fighting the rebellions, but it's gonna be really, really nasty at some point. I would probably have to push for um, mercs. On the other hand, I mean, I have the money to go for tons and tons of mercs. 
So maybe we'll just keep him down with force. I don't know. For now, thank you very much for watching. Hope you join me next time. Bye bye.